and welcome to another video. Today I have uh, Fiat Talento 2019 and he come to us from another service because he have problem with ABS sensor. They replaced the ABS sensor on the rear left and the car still doesn't work. I scan the car. You noticed we have two problems here but this will be interesting for us. And after scanning the car, I have these results. Then almost nothing. This diagnostic, it show me no information. I don't know what means this, but if they scan the car, in another service, I suppose they use the Hella Goodman because most of the people in the service use the Hella Goodman. And we go forward. Okay. From here, because I don't have information about this error, I search on the Google with that error, you find nothing. Uh, actually, let's try. I do have internet connected and search for the code. Okay, you'll notice only it's fiat problem, but I don't tell you about this problem. Okay, then Google doesn't help so much because I will show also why all this information they are not related with our problem. And we'll now we go to our data and let's try to look for the speed of the tire. Because, as I said, they replaced the sensor and the car still doesn't run. And when we go on to see the live data, it will show us that this car running with 655 kilometers. And now is the question what the problem it is. We'll search for the problem. If they replace the sensor, I will don't consider this it's uh, replace the sensor. I will start from the beginning. You measure over there if you have continuity of this uh, wire. You can manage also to replace the left sensor with the right sensor and see if the problem change or not. If the problem change to the right side then definitely the sensor is fault. But we don't do so complicated and I will take the sensor out. I will make the measurements and if the wires are good, the sensor is good, then of course will be the ABS issue. From here I'll move to the car, I will search for the problem and I will let you to know what the problem it is, okay? And I managed to found the problem. I will put also the picture here and you will see it was a broken wire. I repaired that one. And now still we have the issue. I don't delete it yet, the, the issue. I just simulate the same problem. I unplug the sensor on the right side. You remember it was on the left side. Only to see which error we have here. And if I go back, we have also same type of error. This diagnostic, it doesn't know about this error. I will plug the Hella Goodman. I will scan the car and let's see if this Hella Goodman, he will give us a different uh, result of this one, of this code, okay? If it's able to indicate us the error or not. And the Hella Goodman is connected. I already scanned the car. And you can notice we have three errors, not only one. The Pro Diag, it doesn't show us the two errors with C0037 and 003A. The first one, it refers to our old problem with rear left. And this one is rear right. As I said, I unplugged the cables because I want to simulate the same problem. Because the, the diagnostic doesn't show me error uh, anymore when I repair the car. And I want to show you an open circuit because it was a broken wire as you can saw it over there on the picture. Okay. And I don't know what should I tell you. I believe the Pro Diag, Diag Zone and... This uh, XTR, they are not uh, to trust anymore on these new cars. This car is 2019 and definitely you cannot use it on these cars anymore when you have this uh, kind of problem. At least on the body and carousel, right? I saw they have a lot of minus there. They are still good for BMW and Mercedes, but not 100% you'll be sure with uh, this diagnostic, okay? 
then these two it doesn't come at all on the on this diagnostic we have only this uh, middle one then in the future think twice before to buy this one because they are not uh, cheap at all if you will buy the software if you'll buy the hardware you'll be close to 700 800 euro i don't know depends where you buy depends on, on these things but if you don't have a proper diagnostic on this case you cannot manage the problem okay you go to live data like me and you'll see there you have uh, bad readings also now if i go on the right side you'll see on the live data uh, we have same speed 655 i believe it was because it's open circuit uh, i hope the video was useful for somebody there i hope you all also understand then using this uh, diagnostic it is not enough it doesn't matter it's pro dag x dag or all this stuff i apologize for this i was interrupted there's not so much to say only be careful which diagnostic tool you buy which diagnostic tool you use because you need the real information each information can be useful for you if you don't have this information you will work round round of the car and find nothing uh, all the time go on the live data and over there you can see the speed of the tires when you have problem with this uh, ABS. This is the first thing what I will do. As I said, after that you check the wires. If you have good wires and you are not sure the sensor what you bought is good or not, you can change the sensor from the right side to the left side and see if the reading change or not. If you have the same problem, then definitely this problem goes to ABS issue, okay? But... This car is really new. I don't know how this thing happens. I don't know how it's possible to have a broke wire there because this wire uh, it doesn't touch. It stay on the good position. It's only, let's say, 10 centimeters far from the plug. I don't know how this corrosion can be there. I believe the, the quality of this wire today on these cars, they are, I don't know, they are very poor, poor quality. This is the answer. But the car is 2019 and have such a problem. It's unbelievable. I hope it was interesting and for somebody there this video is useful and I always thank you for watching. Bye bye.